Hi guys, I've done hi guys, I've done this intro like so many times. It's so weird because I've never done something like this before, so it's a bit hard for me, but I'm just gonna do it. So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be doing a talking video with you guys, and what I'm gonna be talking about is seven signs that you only like the idea of him, meaning that you don't really like him or you know, you like the idea of him like being you you like the idea of having a boyfriend or whatever, but you actually really don't like him. You just like the idea of him being around or having somebody like there to be like, yes, that's my boyfriend. I feel like lately everybody's under that pressure to be like, yeah, I have a boyfriend. Yeah, he's mine. He's my man. That's my man. Oh, yeah, he's doing this for me. He's doing that for me. So I have seven steps or seven points basically that I've written down and I'm going to share them with you. I just have them on my phone, so if you see me looking down, I'm obviously looking at the things I've written to share with you guys. So the first thing is that um, you didn't start to like him, or you didn't like him, you didn't like him. God, okay, the first one is you didn't, you didn't start to like him until he liked you. So, I mean, this is like straightforward. I mean, like, you didn't start to like him until he liked you. So basically, maybe you notice that, yeah. You're like, oh, yeah, this guy likes me. Wow, okay. Maybe I should try and put in some effort. Like, he's trying. Maybe I should try. Let me see where this leads to. And then, bam, you guys are starting something. So that's the first thing. If you notice that you didn't like him in the beginning, like, he was just like, meh. Nah. And then he, all of a sudden, you're just like, ah, oh, let me just, that's one of the things the number two is the thought of being with him is unappealing like if you think about him in long run like oh yeah this is gonna be my boyfriend this is who i'm going to introduce to my friends and be like oh yeah this is this is my man this is who i'm with like it's unappealing to you you just feel like oh god is this who i'm really gonna be like this is my boyfriend like am i gonna do that to myself what no <laughs> so if you feel like that when you're around him that's another sign that you only like the idea of him so number three is you start noticing that you have nothing in common i mean like when you're getting to know someone you try and find like a common ground where you guys can relate and be like oh yeah this is what i have in common you like to watch this i like i like this movie you like this movie too or i like this series you like this series too you know like stuff like that you guys get to talk and, and i mean share things together maybe you like a particular drink there's so many things you can have in common with people but if you find out that you actually don't have anything in common there's nothing that you guys like together or there's nothing no hobbies nothing i mean darling you don't like him you just like the idea of him he's not the right person for you so i don't know what you're doing now <laughs> okay so number four is you really don't know him if you fight figure out that you really don't know him. I mean, like, you don't know much about his family. You don't much know much about his background. You don't know much about where he's from or whatever. And, like, you don't see yourself trying to ask questions or be like, oh, yeah, you should tell me. Tell me about yourself. Like, you know, when you like somebody, you want to know about them. Like, you want to know everything. You want to know every single detail. So it's not like, yeah, I don't know who I'm with. I don't know. Maybe it's just me personally. If I find that I like someone... I like to ask them questions, like, so tell me, I like to he listen to them, I don't know, I like to hear them talk so I can be like, oh yeah, is this the person for me, is this not the person, like, basically get to analyse somebody, so if you figure that you actually don't know him and you're not planning on getting to know him, darling, you don't like him, you just like the idea of him, so let's see, um, what I have on my phone as number five, is you're trying to change him so on this issue it can be both ways because you can actually like the guy and not like maybe one particular thing about him and you're just like you know with this one thing I just wish that he could just change 
that one thing that's different that's different but if you're like hey god i don't like this one i don't like that one i don't like this i don't like i don't like the shoes he wears i don't like the dresses he wears i don't like how he talks i don't like how he combs his hair how he cuts his hair i don't know what is it that you don't like girl if you find yourself doing that just know that you actually don't like the guy if you're like oh i don't like the way he talks especially if you're just trying to change everything about him you actually don't like him you don't like him you just like the idea of him and i feel like you're just wasting your time you should help yourself and move on like just leave the whole situation alone so number six last but not the least i mean this one is harsh but yeah if you if you if if you're happier when he's not there if you feel like you feel more comfortable around people if you feel like you can be more of yourself you're more bubbly you're not thinking that oh yeah is he going to fuck up what's he going to do this that 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 girl you don't like him you, re you really really don't you don't and the last one is you love being in love and this is so deep there's so many girls out there these days that i don't know did they bury you with love or did they <laughs> did they use love potion on you like i don't understand what your problem is <laughs> is it by force to be in love it's not by force it's not by force if you love the idea of being in love you're definitely going to be making all these mistakes because you're going to be thinking somebody's for you when the person is not. You can't say you love somebody and you're trying to change them. The whole idea of loving somebody is you have to love them for who they are, what they are, what they are, how they are. No matter how they act or whatever it is that they're doing, you know, good or bad. You have to love them for that. You can't be like, oh yeah, I love you, but then I'm trying to change you. When. yeah so those are the seven things that i think would let you know if you're just <sighs> so those are the seven things that i think will let you know if you only like the idea of him and if you actually really don't like him so let me know what you guys think about this video i will try to do more videos like this if i get a good response and if you guys seem more interested in this video so um let me know what you think in the comment section down below and um yeah i would be doing videos like this i think i like videos like this and i will try and keep them up so i'll see you guys in my next video bye thanks for watching